Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of Yaw of the Day. My name is Ace Kanti. This episode of Yaw of the Day is brought to you by My Bit Store. My Bit Store. Um, I'm sure a lot of you guys have been to the university, even as high school, you've had an experience like this. But this particular one, the, I don't know those who schooled in a private university because there's a video on TikTok made its way maneuver through to Twitter, about drew Twitter, huh? and then the caption is the life of a private university student. How was life for you if you attended a private university? Because I have seen this morning where people are saying they don't allow private university students to cook. Some private university students to cook, especially in Nigeria, you don't bring rice cooker, you don't bring gas cylinder, stove, burner, uh, uh, every, everything cookable that is going to help you cook. The only thing you can bring is a kettle. And then there's a video circulating where the person, they cook Indomie. Spark, sorry. Indomie spark noodles. Indomie spark spaghetti. Spaghetti noodles. Yes. The person is trying to prepare spaghetti in a kettle. Spago. Spark in a kettle. Let's watch the video. Edini Sardine Salt Two kettles or two <laughs> Mikusam I know how to cook very well so I can identify these ingredients very easily The way they mean it Where am I? Hey! But do we wait, 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 wait? Do we break spark? Let a point of correction. I've been a chef before. We don't break spaghetti. Yeah, yes, spaghetti. Say, mum, boom, boom, mum. You want to prepare spaghetti? Brah. No, please. If that's the case, they will do short spaghetti like a midget. I'm being a short spaghetti. Is thin, thin for a reason. So you put everything inside. How boom, 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 spaghetti say? Hey, I be any girl be a minim, bubune. Bubune, bubunu, bubune. Sardine. Abin. How? No, but how do you eat from this? Serve yourself oh. seven plates, six plates. How do you eat from a kettle? Back back in high school, I know these things used to be common, but I didn't see anyone that cooked in a kettle. Maybe it's only egg that I've seen people boil egg in a kettle. But I've not seen anyone prepare food, spaghetti or noodles in a kettle before. Um, high school, I remember we have prepared rice with an iron. We use iron to prepare rice. I've witnessed some before. You heat the iron and now they are moaning the silver. They see so. And then some people also use buckets. The buckets. Those of you who went to some schools, people use plastic but my school use the metal bucket people use the metal bucket to cook rice and all that but how you do put you see there are some how do you go wash how would you wash this when you are done how would you wash this put on somebody down racket on them if now how school you don't allow people to cook is it by force to use a kettle if if you have money enough money to attend the private school trust me you can buy food Private universities are very, very expensive. Their fees are very, very expensive. So if you don't have money to attend a government and you're at a private university, how can't you buy Wachi 5 CD macaroni in salad? In Nigeria, if you take Ghana 5 CD to Nigeria, you get Wachi one, one barrel. Because 5 CD is like 10 billion naira in Nigeria. How? I don't know. For Ghana, I don't think there are some private because I know people from Central University, they allow them to do this. But Nigeria, the name of the university has not been disclosed yet. But then people were trying to send signals. But I'm not in Nigeria, so I don't know which university exactly they do this. But how would you imagine you visit your friend? Let me cook for us to eat. Or I'm going to bring food. Only for them to serve you from a kettle. <laughs> they serve me from a kettle. 
Now we eat sardine, spaghetti. Oh no, bro. And it's a female. Oh. This is not a guy cooking. Oh. It's a female. Go, go home, prepare this and come back. And we have people who eat. So the next day, see, trust me that when this person is going to bath the next day, oh, he thinks you are Mokobe Shishini. Because there will be some... Pa- you can't clean everything from this. Some pepper go up to church. Jane in the to try Nyakono. Sardine, Ned. How? You don't allow an outdoor to cook his own food. I want to prepare spaghetti. Want to be a, we have some restaurants that you can go there and prepare your own food. Why do you do? Why? It's, it's very disgusting. Yikes. Wait. If this if this is the only food that you prepare food in a kettle, this is not like a university. I'm sure there's an advanced boarding house where you have people who eat this. And I know some SHS, they used to do this. Some of you in the comment section, if you watch the video, some people were not surprised at all. They have done this before. Kettle. Some people use iron. Some people use what? What do you both they cook for school? Iron, kettle, heater. Some people use heater. Rice cook, yes. Some people use rice cooker to prepare stew. Some people use rice cooker to prepare soup. How? Rice cooker to prepare. Some people use rice cooker to prepare okra stew. How? Nah, I just care. I just have been. But wait, wait, a good. Heater. If you have kettle, not heater, kettle. After, I think, um, every kettle, after a minute, educate, after every minute, the kettle for cool down. So how do you use that process to get this? If you use a kettle, after you have plugged the kettle, even when you are boiling hot water, the kettle has been designed in the form of heating hot water. A food that will take you about five minutes. I'm sure... Everything, you see when you want to prepare spaghetti, you prepare the spaghetti separate and then you come and mix it. But then this one, everything, the water, the oil, baking powder, baking soda, Maggi, Jenny, everything. If you are my girlfriend and I see this video, me then you finish. Me, what? Bring a pot to school. If you can bring pot, go home, cook and bring it. I'm sure if they don't allow this, probably they will allow you to bring a fridge. Let's try to respect ourselves in the community we find ourselves in. But then I would want the school authorities to explain to me why they don't allow the students to bring cooking utensils to school. And I be the day. But understand, if you must your mom chance that the same I visited. <laughs> I visited someone in the hostel before. That is saying size 35. Did the kitchen. I asked them if you cook for the whole school. I don't know. Some of you, when they give you the chance, trust me, you are in four in the room. You should know the things you are supposed to bring and the things you are not supposed to bring. How? Somebody bring deep freezer. Deep freezer. How? <laughs> How do you bring deep freezer to level 400? We are motoring. How did they bring the Some people they are so vacuous. People bring, you see, when uh, oh, African parents, when you enter their kitchen, they use their silvers to design. Now, silver, five, five, ten, six, two, so five. Now they are about university. How? Who did the freezer about? Oh, we are not the chest freezer, so I can microwave, not the rice cook. Some people bring and bring cool pots. They've been the bidia kotoko back. How? I'm sure this is the reason. This is the reason why they don't allow you to be the bidia kotoko back. Gas. If you want to bring gas to the university, you should bring the one that the gas day on top. That's what this one, the one on the screen. Not some people bring their fried rice. That's selling that. Are you feeding the whole school? But I understand private school that they assume people have. Like your parents, the hood, because you know the government, legally, tech, near the other near court. But if you want to go to the private level, the fees they high. So if you can afford their fees, they assume that yes, you kettle. 
But they should allow the electric stove, though. If you allow kettle, then I think you should allow electric stove. So, but that thing is very, very risky. But then anyways, that's how people have decided to live their lives. But this particular thing, if you are my girlfriend or if you are my friend and you do this, me, then you finish. If you want to cook, just call me. I'll just buy food for you for six months. We'll be to the animal DD for six months. I can buy food for you, put you on some food plan for one year. Nigeria, if I take 2K to Nigeria, I can feed somebody for three years. Me and they tell you. If you take 2,000 cities to Nigeria, you can feed the university student for three years. 2,000 cities, wait. Wait, you wait. I'm coming. I don't want to talk much. 2,000 cities. 2,000 cities to Naira. 129,428,092. Why? <laughs> 129,428.92 Naira. This one said, if you Google, if you go to the grounds, you go figure 150,000 Naira. You can fit 11 people. I'm sure when Jesus fed 5,000 people, maybe Nigeria is start from. My name is Ace Kanti. This episode of Yaw of the Day is brought to you by My Bit Store. My Bit Store. We out. <laughs>